X W V U T S R Q P O N M L K J I H G F E D C B A. One breath. My talent is balancing flagpoles on my nose. Good morning, Roosevelt, and welcome back to another episode of RTV. We have an awesome show planned out for you today, but before we can get on to the footage, we have some news. Brianna? Thank you, Ethan. The Family STEM Festival is on Saturday, April 16th from 10 a.m. to 2 p.m. at the Alumni Campus Center at Lourdes College in Dubuque, Iowa. The Dubuque Area Family STEM Festival is a community-wide opportunity for families to explore STEM through free and hands-on activities. In other news, ticket sales for the Fame Musical's performance of Grease, school version, will go on sale online at, on April 18th. The website for access to the online sales is ermsfame.weebly.com. The tickets will also be sold in the box office during students' lunches from April 25th to April 28th. The cost is $8. Lauren? Thanks, Brianna. If you are interested in writing a short story for possible publication in Cricket Magazine, please email Mrs. Watson for details. Our School Battle of the Books will take place on Friday, April 22nd in the auditorium. The 6th grade battle will start at 12.30, followed by 7th and then 8th grade battles. Each will take approximately 30 minutes, and all teams that are participating should meet Mrs. Ellers in the auditorium at 12.15. Also, pay attention to announcements next week to find out penny war totals and if administration will have to complete a student challenge. Ethan? Thanks, Lauren. It is now time for this, this week's Guess Who. Can you guess who this adorable little teacher is? If you think you know, or if you have a guess, call in and tell us your guess. Our number is 4981. That's 4981. And just to nail it in your head again, that's 4981. Brianna? Moving on, our school's quiz bowl team is hard at practice, so we will decide to test their knowledge on are you smarter than a quiz bowler? Stick. Messy. <laughs> wow! Are you sure? Yes. Yes, that is correct. What stick can you use to make it? Yeah. So. A match? All right, so I'll give that answer. one to Carlin. Wow. All right, Carlin gets the first point. <laughs> I'm first sure. One. Okay, next one. David's, is anyone keeping David's father has three sons. Snap, Crackle, and what? David? Yes, Wait. correct. What? Yeah. Father's child, a mother's child, yet no one's son. Ding, it's their daughter. Very good. Before Mount Everest was discovered, what was the highest mountain? Ding, on Mount Everest, it just wasn't discovered yet. Abby throws a ball hard, as hard as he can. It comes back to him, even though nothing and nobody has touched it. So yeah, okay. he throws it in the air. All right, he throws it up straight up. Yay. All right, how much dirt is in a hole four feet deep and two feet wide? That is good. All right, the last question. Starting the party. How do you spell hard water with only three letters? It was the yeah. ice. I C E. I'm gonna take that in. Two letters. Two is not a letter. Yeah, two is. Uh uh, honey boo boo. Uh uh. Subtracting three points for the dab. Okay. Oh. <laughs> and our winner is Mashwar. Mashwar. We are the champions. Next up, let's check out what some math students in House 6-3 are doing. Why are you running? Because I'm trying to burn off all the calories that I ate for lunch. How long do you, how do you know how long that will take? Well, I learned in math class that the average person burns off 4.5 calories for each minute of exercise. Oh, okay. You can also find a bunch of information about it in, on flyers in the lunchroom. And, on the, and by the gym, and in the hallways. That's cool. cool. Gotta keep running. Miles is back and has a very important report for you today. Take it away, Miles. It's 
dodgeball season. Remember the five D's. Dodge. Duck. Dive. Dip. And dodge. Good luck. <laughs> Thanks, Miles. To end our show, we will put together we put together a very special video starring Mr. Kunzi and his fiance doing carpool karaoke. What's on your hat? Cheese. What's in your hand? Cheese. What's on your shoe? Cheese. What's on the steering wheel? Cheese. What do you smell like? Cheese. Who today was Mrs. Rigdon's home base. The teacher in the photo was Mrs. Doobie. Again, congrats to Mrs. Rigdon's home base. We'd also like to congratulate Mrs. Easley for being the PBIS Teacher of the Month. Ethan? 
My thanks to Brianna and Lauren for anchoring with me today. That's our show for today. Make sure to check out our RTV Instagram. Have a great weekend, Roosevelt. Also, if you lost a Kindle, we just had one turned into the office, so check it out. Have a good weekend, Roosevelt.